Hello, welcome to my page. If this is your first time, please hit like, subscribe. Tell your friends about the page so I can grow here in 2020. What am I doing today? Well, same old. Just working on the Model T's. And just, uh, you know, keeping social distancing. What I've been doing that since the 90s, pretty much. It's just, you know, I got some new videos out so check it out animal videos and model T I have three model T's in different stages of restoration eventually one day I hope I can be able to just focus mainly on YouTube but as of right now things are going a little slow on YouTube but it ain't gonna stop me I ain't gonna lay down and die like a dog and I'm gonna keep on fighting until I get this channel to take off so uh, with that being known if this is your first time welcome <laughs> I do art occasionally I haven't done it lately because I would spend so much time on making a piece and it wouldn't really uh, you know it wouldn't really take off when I, I put <laughs> uh, some pieces it would take me a week to finish and then when I'm done with it I'll get like four views and then I get mad and I'm like damn it so I have to try a different approach maybe when the channel gets bigger I'll uh, start doing some art again and other things you know I know it's supposed to be visual and you know you're supposed to be social but you know I've never was a social type yeah I have a bunch of videos but it's completely different vibe than being in person you know I'm kind of a lone wolf in person I kind of just keep to myself Anywho, yeah that's what I do I work with animals teas classic cars and well animals and I do gardening and I like nature and all that other stuff but you know that's just generally how it is for me yeah I stay in an RV I don't have much money to get all the fancy cameras so I have to use all these different apps like the adjusting things but it uh sometimes it's hard to continue you know Sometimes I think about quitting, but then I think quitting is worse than anything you can do. You gotta always try. When you think about quitting, that's when you work your hardest. And don't give up, because that's what I'm doing. I'm not giving up. I'm not being pressured. I'm just having fun here, and if someone likes it, congrats. Thank you. <laughs> so, yeah. Anywho. Oh, yeah, I grew this back. I was trying to do the, the old gothic look again, but, you know, what's the point? Especially when you live out in the middle of nowhere, you know. Anywho. Yeah, this is what I do to, you know, the garden and, and stuff. There's Chinese houses and all this other stuff in there, and, you know, sage and. Basically, uh, oh yeah, there's some old signage, you know, but anyhow, yeah, the T's and stuff like that, it's a four-cylinder engine, it's just, you know, I have to keep working on, there's my extra one, that's going in another Model T, yeah, I say, oh, Ricky, that stuff costs a lot of money, not necessarily, you see, when you're the first person to get to something, you don't have to pay a middleman. You don't have to pay the finder's fee that the parts dealer gets. Now, see that engine right there? That engine only paid $250 for it. And if I got it from a parts dealer, it would have been $650. So, by getting it from 
a person instead of the parts dealer, you cut out the middleman. You make a good amount of money basically by saving on parts because when you're a car junkie, when you work on cars all the time, pretty much the money that you save goes back into the other cars. Anywho, I hope you had fun talking to me today or, you know, watching me, <laughs> talking to me. Yeah, 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 but, you know. You might be talking down in the comment section down below. Anywho, talk to you folks later. Bye.